Hey everyone, AZ and MJ from Endless RV and we're here with another industry update regarding the potential ban of generators in California. If you remember that video we did, essentially CARB, the California Air Resource Board, passed legislation rules that would greatly reduce the emissions of, or require reducing of the emissions mm -hmm. of spark ignited generators that weren't permanent to a home of less than 25 horsepower, which would essentially affect a lot of generators that come on motorhomes. So it wasn't saying that you couldn't use a generator if you had it already, but basically it was saying that this was going to be banned by 2028. Right, there was gonna be a, a gradual increase of the emissions right. requirements mm -hmm. and then phasing it out. Now this elicited a strong reaction from the mm -hmm. RV industry. Cummins, which is the big green machine mm -hmm. in uh, RV generators, uh, they issued a statement back then because it would have covered both liquid propane and gas, essentially saying that by the end of 23, they were not gonna be selling generators anymore going to California. So the RV industry obviously was a little concerned. They were saying that they would lose a million dollars in sales if these regulations- Just the first year. In one year. Well, there's an old hip hop song that I used to love. It's called Cream. Cash rules everything around me. And cash <laughs> rules everything around the RV yeah, industry. It does. So on January 10th, 2023, there was a statement released by Cummins and in quotes, it says, with significant investment in product development, we now intend to take a phased approach to release a portfolio of CARB SOAR compliant products in early 2024. SOAR is CARB's acronym for small off-road engine regulations. With those regulations have certainly made some RVers pretty sore. Dun dun dun. <laughs> it was apparently enough to get Cummins generators into a new technology realm. So they are they are saying they are going to have generators that will comply with the emissions by 2024. So what is still available to get in California? This is until late 2023. These are the models, the Onan 2500, Onan 2800, Onan 3600, Onan 4000, Onan 5500, and Onan 7000 models. And those are all the, uh, the gas and liquid right. propane models, but come to the end of the year, Cummins said something is coming to Cummins is coming to you got some serious to replace them going. now. Cummins representatives did not say what this technology is. They did not give prices. They really didn't give much information other than they will have something that will be carb compliant to replace these generators. Mon is this a good thing? Is this a bad thing? Money, I don't know. Money talks, right? Mm -hmm. Money talks, money and talks. it's amazing how when things change, all of a sudden now they are able to go and that's good i mean that's good i mean it's not a great it's it's good law, but it's good and it's bad and i'll i'll say why i i kind of don't like it is that they were kind of forced to get this mm -hmm. out right now i don't i don't know what the development was if they were trying to develop this for a long time but here's the issue you never want to be the first year correct. customer correct those own and generators are true and tested and they go on forever and ever and ever. I would assume, we would assume there is going to be a lot of bugs to work out. Mm -hmm. It's probably going to be more expensive than what's currently on the market, but it'll probably get better over time. And if it burns cleaner and it does the same job, that's great. great. But I wouldn't want to be the first year customer on that. So in the comments below, let us know what you think about this. We had a feeling, I believe back when we did this, that we said technology Something's will catch come. up. Yeah. It always does. Put in the comments below. And if you like videos like this, to the left of us, we're gonna put our playlist for RV news as well as our RV DIYs playlist. A lot of good information there, guys. And for myself and MJ, it's a journey of a lifetime, and we'll see, see you, you on, on the road. road.